Myrtle Beach 2025 beautiful sunrise and as we look down the beach and down at the pool 15th floor yes faint sound and I think I see a chain down there I believe I got a chain I know I got a chain Wow it does look like silver can't really see any markings on it right yet but wow, I didn't think the old Knox could pick that up, but it did. Nice. I think I got a chain down here, I'm not sure. Let's see what comes out. Oh yeah. It's definitely a chain. I cannot believe it. But I'm finding some... Chain. Usually these machines will not pick up chains. This is the second one I've found with that Knox. The uh, first one was 925 silver and this certainly looks like gold. But boy, I tell you what, I don't see any clasp on it. It looks like it's been broken. I might dig another hole here just to see if I can find the rest of it. But boy, that definitely looks like gold all the way. Very light though. <laughs> Probably not much value, but it definitely looks gold no tarnish whatsoever pretty nice find sounds like a penny and it is lucky penny of the day that's got to be a first I've got nail clippers but uh, this looks like some kind of a cuticle fingernail tool not sure but came up as a negative sound but it was pretty solid so I thought I'd have to try and dig it and yeah you just never know down here at the beach I thought I had another penny but I believe it's a ring very small but yeah I think it's a ring oh it looks like a toe ring Good chance it could be silver. Definitely have to clean it up, but it definitely has that black color as silver would have. Yeah. Definitely, definitely take that. Bring in the scoop. Nice. Our Myrtle Beach. Part of an earring or a bracelet. Yeah, well, well. That is some kind of a dangerous hook. Wow. Hopefully I won't stab myself, but we'll get that definitely off the beach. On top the sand. It's like a 10. I'm guessing it's nothing valuable. Part of an earring is my guess as well. In the pouch guys on camera I'm looking for this young lady's phone I don't want to burst your bubble I did not find it but oh, I just I just want to show you what you can find in there oh rings 
I just want to show you. I, you find things. Yeah. I, I yeah. don't know if it's valuable or not, but probably it is. <laughs> I don't. Well, it could not be though. But it's not your phone. But I'm trying. I'm going back and forth. If you haven't noticed, yeah. as the tide goes, I'll try and find it for you. But let's Thank just see you. what we got here. Looks like a lot of shiny shine. Yeah. You look at the real diamond. Well, it's got. There, it looks like some copper coming through, huh? Hey, you never know, it's got right? It's a tiny ring. <laughs> tiny it is. It's, a, it's shining back blue. That's. Yeah. It's what? It's shining back blue. That means that it's not it just could, a cheap plastic. It could be cold, huh? It could. It could be. Huh. Let's see in the sun here if we see any. Any. Oh, there's yellow. So. Oh, that's fake. Yeah. It's. It could be just really cheap. What I call a junker. What I call junkers. Yeah. I find a lot of junkers, but I do find gold and silver as well. You got some kind of piece of jewelry here. Has that yellow look to it, and the numbers were right for gold. Let's see what we got. Well, it, I don't know. Usually the shanks gold on these if it's gold. It's still a pretty nice find. I'll have to check it later, but eh, for the love of me, I cannot see it. Just got into surf there and. Dug it out, brought my scoop up here, dumped it out, and I think I got a, a ring in the scoop here. Really small, another dainty little toe ring looking thing. Yep, it is a toe ring. Oh my god. Yeah, it's very similar to that other one found yesterday. <laughs> Definitely going to be silver. Got that black color to it. Yeah, another ring in the scoop. This Knox is tearing them up. Equinox by Mine Lab. I think it's a ring. I'm hoping it's gold. <laughs> the numbers say it was gold on the Knox. Oh, really? Let's see what we got. What do you think? <laughs> treasure. Might be an earring, too. I don't know. No, it's a ring. Right, it looks oh like my. a wedding ring. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's a diamond? I don't know. I'm like, holy crap. Like this I'm like, I put that in my hand. I'm like, don't lose it, don't lose it, don't lose it. Because I was walking. Yeah, yeah. yeah I know. <laughs> That's a dandy. That, that is, is a dandy. Look at the serrations on that. Take a picture of that and send it yeah. to Teresa. Oh. I will. Yeah. Yep. I'll set the other oh, one around it. Oh, baby doll. Yeah. Oh yeah. my goodness. Beautiful, beautiful. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh, now see, she tells me to put a filter on. Now she wants to bite me. Okay, baby, let's go up to the room. Hard to do here at the ocean is find little stud earrings. Unlike back in PA in my Pennsylvania <coughs> lakes, I can get them up pretty good. But down here, they fall through a lot. But lucky enough to get this one. Little heart stud earring. Pretty nice signal here, 1920. Not sure what it is, but like oh it's a key or a ring it's a key ring <laughs> holy cow that was a nice signal out of that hole as grave digger max would say gray matter not a little one either Well, I found a stud earring and it fell through the scoop. And I've been doing it. Oh, there it is, I think. Yep, there it is. It's low numbers. I don't think it's gold. It looks copperish. It's kind of rare for me to find a stud earring down here, but that's number two. I think yesterday was number one. I turned the camera on this morning, but got a solid nine. Let me fill this hole back in real quick. We'll see what we got here. Oh boy, I think I got a ring. 
pretty sure. It's a nine. Nine on the Knox. Let's see what we got here. Check the hole again here. Finish filling it in. Must be a wedding band. I'm gonna guess it's. Wow, thought I had a piece of trash, but believe it or not, it's another freaking tow ring. Another tow ring. Must have had a sale down here on these. And I guarantee you, that's a silver tow ring. Definitely with that color, that patina. Nothing fancy. That is like the, that is the third one that I found on this trip. I think I found one of these in quite a while. I believe it's a 50 caliber bullet from World War II practicing here on the beach. Got to block the wind here a little bit. Yep, pretty sure that's what that is. 50 caliber fired, you can actually see the rifling on it. It's been a couple of years since I found one of these. That's a cool find. I don't think a year goes by that I don't find some kind of a pocket watch, and this thing was very shallow. Already showing good signs of rust. A pocket knife. And here we go. Another pocket knife. Yeah, she's pretty bad shape though. Lost a while. I think I got a ring. Uh huh. Yeah. I couldn't run too fast. I didn't want my tits to jiggle too much. <laughs> uh, you're on camera now. Watch what you say. <laughs> <laughs> but what do you think? Over oh there. Oh my God. Over there, I dig an earring coming up to her. Yeah. I, it's just crazy, and here I had a this very similar sound, yep. and I'm going to guess, I don't know if it's silver or not, but... Maybe. Oh my god. Oh boy, that looks pretty fancy. Yeah. Looks, looks silver, it don't does, it? It does look silver. Oh my god. Isn't that crazy how you just come across and there's something right in front of you? Oh, 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 oh. Look at this. You got a little uh, brush? No, with me. Did you... <laughs> Have you got your toothbrush on you? No. <laughs> you definitely not be on. It's still on. Is it blinking? Oh, no, no, oh, yeah, no, no. I just found that one at that hole right there. Another toll. No, oh, it's a earring. sparkly earring. Yeah. Oh, my God. Jesus. And that's got to be silver as well. It got to match. Look, it almost matches. Look, stuff's coming up. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. That's definitely a man's ring. Yeah. And you didn't walk very far. Just no, stay well, there I mean, I walked coming down there. Oh. I know you did. I was, but I was coming back to get I, get a I smoke and a, I should have, yeah. something to drink, but that's oh, pretty cool. That is beautiful. And it's got weight to it. So does that earring. Feel that earring. Oh, do it ever. That's a heavy son of a gun. Look at the sparkle in it. I know. I thought, I thought it was right. good. Hey, is that crazy? How I walk all that distance and I found nothing. I come back and find two finds right in front of you guys. <laughs> Hold on to them here until I turn this camera off. Please. Oh, there's the earring. <laughs> And the second hole is the ring, right here, all that way. Yeah. Find it warm. Find it warm. Oh, it's yeah. 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 It's, it's very warm today. Compared to yesterday, yeah. the humidity is on my birthday. Yeah. Not sure, what I got here it looks like a yellow, gold-colored something or other. Turn the camera on. We'll see what we got. Oh, it looks pretty nice. Ah, boy, I'll tell you, she's got some yellow to it. Oh, my goodness. There's something root on the stem there. I think I got a piece of gold. Definitely a piece of gold. Can't read it. Something 8K or 
14k 14k piece of gold hallelujah nice it's got a little bit of weight to it not a whole lot but definitely a keeper nice yeah I just got some kind of a earring looking thing yep some kind of an earring looking thing Not sure what I got here, but it's like possibly some piece of jewelry. Not sure. We're going to find out. Yep, some kind of bling. Half an earring or half a ring. Not sure. PA Digger doing the Myrtle Beach wrap up for this year. I've got it all spread out on the table. Pretty good amount of digging, that's for sure. Equinox 600. Stava scoop again this year with a carbon fiber handle. And we'll just tear right into it. A lot of fishing sinkers, gray matter, an old pocket knife, carabiner, keys. Stainless steel bolts, stainless steel washer, a couple of chains, junk earrings, out the gazoo, a stainless steel cross, looks gold but it's not, some sea glass, some bullet casings, that is a 50 caliber bullet, that's a pretty cool find. Sunglasses were found by someone else on the beach, I just added it to the collection. Couple lighters, only one toy this year, a little motorcycle, batteries, some kind of Dremel tool, and of course paper clips, tent stakes, bottle caps, various amounts of wire and trash, pool tabs, little miniature bottle, aluminum foil out the gazoo. Here's the coins. There's one token right here in the middle, Chuck E. Cheese. Pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters. 138 total coins came to $10.99. Certainly can't get rich off of that, but man, it was a lot of digging, a lot of fun. 14 rings this year. Kind of fun. The three silver toe rings. A man silver ring, silver earring, silver earring, silver chain, and some junk rings. Nothing really to write home about. And today I found, the last day, I found a 14K earring. So I had silver and gold on this trip. I'll back away here and you can take a pretty good look at all the finds. Kind of amazing what you dig up at the beach. You become the beach janitor. And don't let me forget, Mrs. P.A. Digger was digging the teeth this year. Quite an assortment. I didn't bother counting them, but there's got to be at least 75 to 100 teeth there. Some really, really nice ones. But the icing on the cake was this tooth here. And our good friend Perry and Marion from Newfoundland, he wraps teeth. And he wrapped that tooth for her and we got her a silver chain, but she found that tooth this year. It is a dandy. A lot, a lot of looking for shark teeth. Back away again and you can see the assortment. A lot of fun at Myrtle Beach. We love it. Myrtle Beach 2025. PA Digger. Later.